Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Ingenious Brands new stand limited series debuts to two million views. This article is off of the Motley Fool website. It says Genius Brands ticker symbol G N U S may finally have a reason for issuing one of its usual breathless press releases. Following the debut of its animated children's TV show, Stan Lee's Superhero Kindergarten, on Friday. Appearing on Genius's cartoon channel and featuring the voice of talent of Arnold Schwarzenegger, the double episode premiere delivered more than 2 million views over its opening weekend. Okay? It says, because, uh, because the late Stan Lee created some of the most recognizable superhero comments, including Spider-Man, Iron Man, Avengers, and X-Men, Genius Brands has been able to ride his coattails after announcing it would be developing shows based upon his intellectual portfolio. Yes, yet it would not be those well-known characters Genius would be showing, but rather lesser-known properties that were created after his deal with Disney. Marvel Entertainment, such as Lucky Man, Man and Alter Ego, which few people have heard of. One of the programs that grew out of its arrangement with Lee's POW Entertainment was the development of superhero kindergarten action adventure cartoon series to promote health and fitness. Exclusive to Genius's digital friendly cartoon channel, which launched in January, it can be assess, accessed on both Apple and Android devices, as well as Amazon Prime on connected TVs and devices. That Genius was able to get over 2 million views for this series is a testament to the draw both Stan Lee and Arnold Schwarzenegger still possesses. Genius Brands has also attracted a follow following among investors, taking the breezy hyperbole of the media company's press releases. Its stock typically rises and falls with every new issue only to tumble some time later as the hype often fails to live up to the expectations. Superhero Kindergarten, though, should at least give them something more substantial to hang on to for a while. So, uh, if you were paying attention to the stock market, uh, just about everything was up today, including Genius Brands, okay? And speaking of Arnold Schwarzenegger, he's going to be on Jimmy Kimmel Live today. Uh, Genius Brands actually tweeted that out today. So, if you are uh, able to watch, that would be cool to maybe take a look at um, and, you know, see if he... Know, kind of what he talks you know what he talks about and see if he you know promotes the company and maybe give a little buzz going into tomorrow so let's take a look at the charts really quick and see what they're telling us give you some key support and resistance levels and we'll go from there all right guys so genius brands ticker symbol g n u s we busted above that one dollar and seventy cent resistance level so now that 170 is acting as support in order to break trend and confirm that we're in an uptrend we need to go above and stay above two dollars and make that act as support your next major level of resistance would be 229 so uh, just an fyi also on the rs side down here guys we are overvalued so if we do get a little push up uh, in my opinion i think we're going to get rejected around that two dollar mark and bounce back down and maybe retest that dollar 70 before uh, hopefully bounce Coming up to try to test that 229 resistance level. But keep that in mind right now. We are in overvalued territory. So in my opinion, if you're looking to get in, still a decent buy under $2. But if you're looking for a swing, not the best time. You want to wait until it pulls back slightly, maybe in the 170s or 170 itself, and see if it bounces off of it. That would be a good sign. All right, guys, that's all I have for you in this video. Make sure that you smash the thumbs up button if you found value in today's video. And if you enjoy our content, of course, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell. That way YouTube can let you know every time we release new content. Other than that, guys, we'll catch you in the next video.